let's keep playing Brigandine, because it ain't over till it's over. We were in the attack phase, and we weren't doing anything but moving things around. Merchant! For Estabulate! Oh, come on. I'm Sean Connery. You can do better than that. Come on, something useful. I don't think we've seen that one before. She, like, drank the water, passed out, and... Got power. Love Whip and Fairy Pups. Maybe she's finally gotten over her fear of coins. Ah. Uh. The old lover's tale. I think I'm actually going to do some more swapping around before the actual attack again. I realized we've only got like four, maybe five battles left in the entire game. So if we're ever going to shaft, let's see, shaft cut loose with Meteor Doom. He's the only one who'll be able to. Ah, you can't even pick up non-cursed robes. It is the curse of malaria. You lot just go on a quest. Quest, 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 quest. You kill off who has shaft. And I'll do it. 95. You're a hundred. But you're a quick one. Oh, that is raising his running power, huh? So we can't really get any better than this thing. I think I'm going to send Kilo up there to hang out with Lioness. Send someone back down to help Finn. Yes. It's Vaz. It doesn't need to be class changed, does it? Right now. I think he may actually be better than Paternus. Just just because he's got the whole He can cast power. 
that's the thing you get about the lower level characters is they can be actually messed around with the class changes. And it's probably as Gary's Empire's biggest flaw in the long run. Wow, that's a lot of things to send off on quests. so many of them have become irrelevant because you only need two teams of three here to finally end it once and for all. One last check to make sure that everyone's got the highest level. make us fight lands because that would be horribly stupid. I forget what the Bell of Comfort does. I'm hallucinating again. The animals are talking to me. collapsing tower for a while. find those the, the way to get those out Victoria that's like the fourth time you've failed at it which me I should probably use the items I've got Anything good for shaft Caesar can actually suffer severely from losing. We're going to use the agility on him. Kilo, I should have thought of this earlier. I suppose that makes it a bit late now, but... Also, so once he gets Meteor Doom, it's devastating. Linus, and we use the lives on her to keep her from falling apart. Let's see if there's anything better than the Almighty Wing for her. I thought the comfort's just some more power. She 
really does have really weak equip options. I think Almighty Ring was the best choice in the long run. So Ring of Sorcery is a good alternative thought. Asmit is using the Wise Man Metal. You turn into when the Ring of Sorcery is just flat out better. Gilof is using his Kusanagi. We do have units that can be promoted by the alt by the power up items, so I just want to keep sending them out. Any little edge we can get. And time for a messy battle. I mean, I know I always say I may retreat from these and then seem to end up going for it anyway, but... If there really is, it could go either way. Oh, come on. Kai, Dindane, who else? You're kidding. Ty's coming from one direction and the others are coming from the other? And they're weighted down with golems and... If I didn't want to just beat up on Kai on principle to end this so I can get on with it... Loaded down with stuff to kill, though. That's the max range of his Geno Thunder. Honestly, if we can force him to weep to use Geno Thunder pathetically, then I'll consider it a win. Otherwise, if he advances even like a space, it's a win. figure. Romulus and Remus get to go into action again because they're ranged. And Felting Kai with huge amounts of arrows is a great way to tick him off. start breaking some of those. I know we'll get a whole counter-attack from Kai thing. If all he's got left is himself, he won't actually be able to finish off anything if we're not stupid. Ooh, 
don't need to. We're not in a particularly desperate position. the levels of stuff they've got down there.
Ha <laughs> Pretty good share of all that stuff. Down he goes. To complete ponage. And now to see how wiping out New Almechia goes. Targeting the knights themselves as soon as possible is the most important thing. Also, getting well coordinated and in place first is important. You don't want to have this mess up. Bringing Orlock may have messed it up. Nah, it won't mess anything up. It just means we have a guy that can probably just snipe a couple things and won't be a bit. And I'm rambling like a loon again. on any of these things, but it's still going to be a tough and long drag out fight. They have to down all their rune knights to it. Dragon is probably the highest level thing they've got. Paid off. Oh, 
far better point man. Nonetheless, it gives us the aerial advantage. Zaldun, but we're in a great position to take out Garyan because of it. That's not going to do you any good. Oh man, you got to go first. That messes things up slightly. Not even kidding. Massive spamming of holy words put some serious hurt on Garion and Maligan both. Especially with Maligan's low int and double darkness thing.
or just plain old Aldoon healing. Melligan's not gonna go down. tell you, they're afraid to attack. Have you heard the word? We're spreading it to every corner of this continent. Aggressive evangelism.
Oh, you can holy word again? Excessive amounts of magic! Well, this might get Melligan, actually. You're fine by me, really. There he goes. Jeff does need to kill something, though, to max, max out and get me your doom. Well, max out, not max out. I've been picking on Aldoom. Let's yeah. If you didn't see that coming, then you probably haven't been paying attention to what his class does. And yes, I saw that one coming. One more round to get rid of coal here, but don't mind too much. Yeah, it's gonna have to be the scorpion cleared out of the way. But he's got enough experience that winning will level him now. Now, of course, as they say, completely boned. I'm gonna be greedy and see if we can't let him get one more turn to be get beaten up by Shaft. Yeah, you don't need any experience.
for it, Chef. Huh, still staying in there, eh? Two hundred and fifty nine. And thus goes Almechia. show up for the last battle. 